What is going on guys and welcome back for episode one of season three. Um, as you may or may have not noticed, uh, the first two seasons I have been doing the episodes continuing from the first season. So for example, season two, episode one, I have done a season two, episode 12. Um, I have had a few people mention why have I not done it as season two, episode one. And the reason for that was when I've seen other other creators have their all their content in the playlist, sometimes it can be a bit confusing because you can't quite see which season it is and you'll see season 23 and you can't make out how far in the season they are but um for that, anyway i am i am going to reset that and hopefully the thumbnail will be nice and clear for you to see this is season three episode one and today we take on liverpool if you haven't seen the season season three preview where you can see our new signings and and our squad in more depth then please go and watch that because i am going to do things differently this year the episodes are going to be going to be shorter i'm aiming to keep the episodes about 10 minutes or less each episode we are going to play liverpool only today no we will not be as many live comms and um, i mean if this episode does end up being very short then i can possibly look to do a double header to make it about 12 13 minutes long so anyway without further ado let's get into today's game here we go guys, and the lineups are announced. In goal we have Bielkowski, along the back four we have Kenlock, Davies and Watmore with Walker Peters on the right. Kane and Downs of centre field. Up front we have Wellington, Dazelle, Diaz and Vellami. Of course, if you haven't seen the season preview, uh, Davies is one of our new signings, come from Preston for six million. On the right hand side we have Jill Diaz, my name is Monaco, has been started at right midfield instead of Madison because Madison apparently does not fit into the core social group and may not be gelling with the squad. So for that reason, I'm going to play Diaz today. Ben Flamini keeps his place up front. Of course, Pellegrini on the bench, one of our new signings, from, again, on Lone Mass Monaco. We have not heard of him. I do recommend you check him out. He is in the game at the beginning of the game. He's actually very good now, so he must be one of the big wonder kids this year. Also, one of our new signings on the bench is Unai Lopez on loan from Atletico. Scott McTominay on loan from... Manchester United centre midfielder can play box box or build ball winning, so that'd be a good stuff to have. And we've also got Andre Almanid on loan as well, who can play left or right back. The time for Liverpool today, they have Alisson Becker in goal. Back four, they have Kieran Tierney, of course, uh, starts the game with Celtic. Centre back, they have Van Dijk and Gomez with Trent Alexander Arnold on the right. Centre midfield, they have Arthur and Fernandez. Up front, they have Mane, Lalana, Salah, and Firmino. On the bench, Carrius, Guerrero, Fabino, Harry Wilson, Hernandez, Klein and Milner. This should be a big, big test for us. Can we pull off a shot? Come on. First key highlight of the game, and it looks like it's going to Liverpool. If you can see, notice the difference. We've got crowd this year in the, in the gameplay. Firmino on, Lana. Liverpool score. Liverpool take the lead. Oh, is this going to be a difficult game for us? We have got the crowd in the background today. Um, I noticed on my graphics, I've been playing very low graphics. The recommended level is actually low. Dissolve the corner for switch. Diaz, Kane, 1-1. One, one. Get in there. Herbie Kane gets the equaliser. Of course, a player we signed from Liverpool in the first season. He's going to be delighted to score that goal. He's going to be like, yeah, you should have kept me. And we're going to like, you know what I mean? Our game. Anyway, Liverpool now. Next attack. Arthur on edge of the box. What can he do here? Downs into tackle nice and strongly. It's which clear. Falami. Oh, this is exciting. We are playing on balance. We change mentality to balance. It's something we've been doing in pre-season. Good ball for Wellington. Oh, gets a shot off. But Alisson Becker keeps hold of the ball. It remains 1-1. And what an exciting start to the Premier League season it is for us. Bielkowski now. Goal kick. Takes short to Watmore. Out on the right. Comes forward. Flicks the ball forward for Diaz. Starting instead of Madison today. Long ball. Virgil van Dijk has left for it to run to Alison Becker. Flamin was closing down. If you haven't seen the, the semi-final against Swansea yet, Flamin scored a hysterical goal as the, the, the goalkeeper was waiting for the ball to come to him. Didn't come out for it. Flamin was closing down. Slid in, made a tackle and scored from the edge of the area. Of course, to send us on our way to the player final. Wellington now. One-on-one. On one. Oh, my God. We're 2-1 up. <laughs> Wellington scored. We are winning 2-1. Diaz looks like it was a wise move to put him on instead of Madison in the end today as he has been a part of both goals now. He's assisting two goals. Kenlock is on a yellow card. Let's just ease him off tackles. Well, we need to keep things calm here. Ease off tackles. 2-1 up against Liverpool. Who would have thought that? This is very, very exciting. Let's just send the praise out there to the players. Mane heads back in, dips which header out, Mane on the edge, out wide to Jetson, who's on the yellow card, comes inside. Jetson, what can he do here? A cross out to Lana on the wide right. 
Can Lallana put a ball in? No, he's coming inside. He pulls off a shot. Lallana gets his second goal of the game. Liverpool equal things up at 2-2. Well, we can't be too disheartened by that. Going 2-1 up was fantastic. A fantastic achievement considering we had Nubi Ferreira side. It's 2-2 and it looks like it's going to remain that way going into half time. Just a few minutes left now. The clock is ticking down. Final highlight of the second half. Sal of the corner. Mane comes in. Davies clears. Dazelle heads on. Is the referee going to blow up for half time here? Arthur. Into Gomez, Gomez to Jetson. Jetson or Gedson, let me know in the comments, guys. I don't know. Firmino, Salah. Oh, boy, the goal. Yeah, Kowski was in a very poor position there, but Salah knocks it wide and it's half time has come. 2 2. Herbie Kane, of course, scoring the first equaliser against his old club, Liverpool. Lallana scoring two, and Wellington also on the score sheet. I think we can be pleased with that first half. The match stats would certainly suggest that's been fairly, fairly, lit, fairly, um, Fairly equal. Going into the second half, well, I think we're going to keep things how they are. Here we go now. First key highlight of the second half. Headed out there. Kenlock regains possession for Ipswich. What's he going to do? He's got Davies there. Davies, good ball for Downs. Downs forward to Dezel. Dezel to Flami. What can Flami do here? Tackle by Jetson. Wins it back. Oh, what a goal. Wellington. Good ball from Flami. Wellington shoots from outside the box. I wasn't expecting that. Straight into the top corner. And we have taken the lead. 3-2. Can you believe it, viewers? Can you believe it? 3-2 up. Just one promotion from the Premier League. Woohoo! Liverpool now. Next highlight. Tierney on the left. Inside to Arthur. Back to Tierney. Tierney back to Arthur on the edge. Arthur, what's he going to do here? Tries to find uh, Salah out on the right. But it's blocked by the switch and cleared. Van Dijk now. To Tierney to Arthur. Arthur inside the Jetson. Jetson to Arthur. Tries to find Salah. Kenlock, what are you doing? Doesn't make it. Salah puts the ball in. What more clears? Only as far as Mane there on the left. Comes back inside. Downs, late tackle and misses. Davies, good tackle. Go on. You're getting stuck in there. Bial Kelsey comes out and gathers up the loose ball. We are approaching the hour mark. Of course, we haven't made a sub yet. I'm going to keep hold of my, my subs for now, I think. And um, we're also going to change... Our mentalities are cautious. We are winning 3-2. We weren't expecting to be winning. I think if we can drop back a little bit, that will put pressure on Liverpool. Jetson. Oh, there we go. 3-3. Free, free. Jetson Fernandez scores for Liverpool and Liverpool equalised. Well, 3-3. Free, free. What a game this has turned out to be. We're still uncautious. I might look to put that back. We're going to see how things pan out for the next 10-15 minutes. Well, 20 minutes left in the game. Herbie Kane's just got a yellow card. We're just going to quickly ease him off tackles. And we are going to make our first substitutes of the, the, our new Premier League season. We're going to bring on Unai Lopez for Dezel. Dezel's not played very well. Only done a 6.3. Although Flami has been involved in one of the goals, assist in Wellington, we are going to bring on Pellegri. As I see him with a lot of potential, I think he could bag a goal here today. So those are the two subs we're going to make. We are just going to calmly give a team talk. I have faith. They both seem deep in four. The new players, they're not uh, familiar with the way I, I do things at the moment. So we've got to expect them not to be motivated. But come in number five, six games, I, I expect them to be motivated for my team talks. Half an hour for Liverpool. Free kick. Ah, oh, four three. We're just going to switch back to... We're going to think we're going to go positive for the end of this game, actually. Four three down now. We have been... Uh, in the lead twice. I think we should take confidence from that. Trent Alexander, oh my God. What the hell is going on here? Two free kicks in the space of what, five minutes? We're losing 5-3 now. Bloody hell, it's all going to pot. 10 minutes remain. We are still on positive. Liverpool again. We're gonna have to change this balance, I think. It's all, it's all going pear-shaped. Tierney, to Mane. Don't, come on boys. Be proud of your performance so far. Don't mess it up yourselves, Tierney. Kind of down the left hand side with a ball in. Firmino's there, one more clears, only fires. Firmino shoots just over the bar. Looked like Bielkowski had it covered anyway. Next highlight looks like it's going to Liverpool again. Salah now coming forward. Liverpool returned it up the second half. Mane. Oh my god, 6 3. Oh dear. Well, poor old town. What a way to start the year. Again, in the lead twice against Liverpool. Obviously, I think none of us were expecting that. Four minutes remain. Corner kick now. Walker Peters to take. 
There's a ball in, Diaz is there. What more? Get a goal back, 6-4. Blimey, what a game. Final highlight here. Looks like it's going to be the pointless highlight. It is full time. Final whistle. The whistle. The referee blows his final whistle. And we have lost 6-4 to Liverpool. What a start to the game that was. Start to the season, sorry. 6-4. Who would have ever thought that would be such a high scoring game? To score four goals against Liverpool, I think we can take a lot of confidence from that. However, conceding six, especially two free kicks, is a bit of a concern. Um, going forward, I'm not sure if I'm going to change anything. I might leave it for a few games just to see how we get on. But what a good game that was. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Please, if you did, leave a like, leave a comment. Uh, let me know what you, you guys thought of that. We're going to quickly just get through the team talk and then we'll come back to the schedule and see where we come back next. So as far as the team talk goes, I did actually say to the players passionately that despite the result, I was pleased with your performance. I think that's a natural thing to do. We scored four goals in Liverpool. They all seemed confused and switched off. So I'm gutted about that. But I mean, to, to only lose by two goals to Liverpool and score four goals, I think we can be very, very um, encouraged by that performance. So next up, we've got Tottenham. And I think we are going to leave it and come back to... Why is the schedule gone? Why is it not got a month some more? So we've got Tottenham next. We're going to come back for the Arsenal game here. Play Arsenal away. What should we do May United? Hmm. I think we do May United. We'll come back for May United game as they obviously won the league last year. So it's going to be a big chunk of games here we're going to miss. But we've got May United, then Norwich. And I am conscious of doing too many episodes in a season. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm going to get through these games. And we'll be back tomorrow night with the Manchester United game and I mean what we've got eight league games until that game so the, the league's really going to be shaping up hope you guys enjoyed that thanks a lot for watching uh, like any, anyone any of you that are watching haven't got involved in the chat yet please do leave a comment I will get back to you I'm always available on social media to to reply and get involved and um, yeah fantastic start hey guys come on you blues come on get in there come on